What if your leader was your greatest threat? Picture a nation on the edge of chaos. It's 1971 and Uganda is gripped by political instability. The stage is set for a power shift, and it comes in the form of a military coup. The man at the helm, IDI Amin Dadaumi, an imposing figure, he emerges from the shadows to seize control, promising peace and stability. Yet beneath the surface, something darker lurks. Amin's rule, however, was soon to reveal its true and terrifying colors. Amin's rule was not one of peace, but one of fear and violence. As if a switch had been flipped, Uganda was plunged into a reign of terror that would last for eight long years. Amin's paranoia and lust for power led to a shocking purge of the Asian population, ejecting thousands of individuals from their homes. Businesses that had thrived for generations were seized overnight, their owners powerless against the might of Amin's regime. But the terror did not stop there. Widespread human rights abuses became commonplace as the dictator tightened his grip on power. Countless Ugandans were subjected to unspeakable torture, while extrajudicial killings became the order of the day. A climate of fear pervaded the nation, with citizens living in constant anxiety of who would be next to disappear. It was a time when the rule of law was replaced by the rule of one man, and that man was IDI Amin. The reign of terror was only just beginning. Rumors of cannibalism began to circulate, but could they be true? In a world already aghast at IDI Amin Dada Umi's brutal reign, these whispers added an extra layer of horror. Allegations of cannibalism were not uncommon. Amin himself supposedly confessed to the act, a claim that sent chills down the spine of the international community. It was said that he ate human flesh not out of necessity, but as a show of power, a terrifying demonstration of his total control over life and death. Whether this macabre statement was a twisted joke or a horrifying truth, remains a matter of debate. Yet it was undeniable that Amin's reign was marked by an insatiable hunger for power and control, a hunger that seemingly knew no bounds. These shocking revelations were just a glimpse into the horrifying reality of Amin's rule. The man-eater, whether literal or metaphorical, was a chilling symbol of a dictator who devoured everything in his path. Amin's desires and pleasures were as disturbing as his rule. This man, whose reign was marked by a brutal suppression of dissent, had a personal life that was just as tumultuous. A notorious polygamist, Amin reportedly had as many as five wives at one point. But his relationships were far from harmonious. Allegations of abuse ran rampant, painting a chilling picture of domestic life under his roof. But Amin's desires extended beyond his personal life. He had a fascination with military power that was unparalleled. He reveled in the might of his forces, using them to quash any opposition that dared to rise. His rule was marked by the iron fist of military might, a testament to his insatiable hunger for control. Yet these desires, as horrifying as they were, only scratched the surface of the man that was IDI Amin Dada Umi. Amin's rule was a dark chapter in Uganda's history. Every reign of terror must come to an end. This was the case for IDI Amin Dada Umi, whose rule of Uganda came crashing down in 1979. His fall from power was as tumultuous as his reign. As the international pressure mounted and his regime's atrocities came to light, Amin found himself cornered. His once iron grip on Uganda slipped and he was forced into exile. However, the end of his rule did not mean an end to the suffering of the Ugandan people. The aftermath of his regime left a nation in ruins Thousands of lives were lost, families torn apart, and an economy left in shambles. The scars of Amin's rule ran deep. Beyond the physical damage, his reign inflicted lasting psychological trauma on the people of Uganda. His name became synonymous with fear and oppression, a terrifying reminder of the power of tyranny. The fall of Amin marked the end of a dark chapter in Uganda's history but it also served as a stark reminder of the devastating effects of unchecked power. The legacy of his rule is a haunting testament to the human cost of dictatorship. IDI Amin Dada Umi, a name that will forever be etched in history as a symbol of tyranny and terror. His reign may have ended, but his impact lingers on, a chilling reminder of the horrors that unfolded under his rule.